In this segment, we are going to try the most expensive games from Steam. And after each game, we are going to answer the question, is it worth it? No! Hell no! We've got four games and each game costs $200. I think that must be the dollar limit because the only games more expensive than that are VR games. We're not trying VR. These are all standard games. Let's see. We are diving in. Are you all ready for game number one? Our first $200 game is called Super Fight. Everyone pick right or left. I like this guy's abs. This guy is jacked. I'm picking right. Let's launch in. Punch him. Pick up the knife. Oh, guys, this is smooth. I kind of like this gameplay. I like the graphics. You get him. Kick, 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 boom. Get these spiky, ugly looking mohawk dudes out of here. Run. Ah! Are you running? There's only one left. How long does this go for? Is there a boss? Nope. I think the punch is more effective than the kick. On to the next level, baby. Is this the same level? What? What the f Maybe it's gonna be more difficult this time. Pick up the knife! Get him out. I'm kicking all of them at once. I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! Let's go! Next level. Okay, this is the exact same. Let me back out. Guys, I can't back out. I'm clicking escape. I'm clicking everything. I feel like I just got ripped off. So we ask ourselves the question, is that game worth $200? What do you guys think? <laughs> I kind of like the mechanics of it. I like how smooth it feels. I kind of like the graphics, but it, maybe if it added some more levels. First one, thumbs down. Don't buy it, not worth $200. Our next game is called Arcade Drift, and it is also $200. In we go, baby. Immediately right off the bat, music is a huge plus. This is good songs. How is this game 200 bucks? We are breaking the record. We still have a ways to go. Oh God, we're off. Holy! Look at that trick shot, baby. Do I even have to drive on the road? No. It's so smooth. It's better than the first game, I'll tell you that. Well, duh. Oh my God, I'm still going. No! We're gonna get a 4,000 drift. We're up to 5,300. We're gonna be the record holder. <laughs> <laughs> is the game fun? Yes. Is it realistic? No. So I can literally drift until infinity. All we need is 14 more thousand. That's it. We're up to 10,000. Oh no. No! We were gonna break a world record. Our score was gonna be in the upper right-hand corner. Look what you did. Let's do a different map. Hey, look, we've got some people in this one. Where are the humans, homies? I'm not gonna get stuck again, right? <laughs> what? The odds of that happening right after I said that, there's just no way. I've had enough. I wanna go to the next one. Soundtrack, 10 out of 10. Gameplay, three. Was it worth $200? That was actually a fun game. I actually enjoyed it, minus the, the brutal screeching. Don't know if I enjoyed it worth $200 though. No shit. All right, game number three is also $200. It is called The Island of Dr. Yepstein. I wanna be clear, Dr. Yepstein, not Epstein. That would be a very different island. Here we go. I got a sneak peek yesterday when I launched the game to make sure it worked. And I heard the best voice acting I've ever heard in a video game. Are you ready for this? Check this out. Three, two, one. Hey, Cam. You're a cheat in this game. Hey, Matt, hey, wait! Who did the redemption at the last freaking second? Ready? So, I'm on this call. I had- Rejection, hearsay. Are you guys serious? I'm trying to get you guys to listen to this. So, I'm on this spot. I had to sail on a boat to get a notice. See it, Sean. You did the Can we pause the freaking redemptions? You guys suck. Here we go. Guys, listen up. This is important. I'm trying to show you guys something cool. Bob, this is your fault. This is you. Bob, I blame you for this. How dare you? We're gonna try this one more time. For starters, you need to acquire weapons. Look in the nearest hut. Be careful, Hunter. We don't know what this mysterious island holds. That's what I was trying to show you guys. So this game actually is kind of fun. This might be the best one so far. So first things first, let's get to the objective. Oh. Damn it, the connection is gone. You need to find and connect as many as 5G towers on the island as possible. Um, there should be coordinates on the map. Why does it sound like Brian, the TTS bot, is doing the voiceovers for this game? All right, let's check the map. I just want to kick some ass. Give me a gun. I want to shoot some people. <laughs> I'm stuck in the tower. Where do I go? Everything's freaking dark. I can't see anything. Uh oh, we've made it down. 
The hell was that? What's the thing on the right? <clears throat> Run! What is happening? Ooh, we got some health. Let's go. Aha! I bet there's a gun in here. Oh, yeah, baby! It's game time. Let's kill some enemies, my friends. We have another gun. Is it a sniper? Oh, yes. The music just started playing, which makes me a little bit nervous. Aha! I believe we are looking at an enemy base. We are infiltrating enemy territory. Sniper? <laughs> I thought that was a person's head. Where is everyone? Hello? Oh. Die. 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 Hey. Easy, baby. It's just like a, a regular first-person shooter game. Sort of like COD, but way worse graphics. Not bad, though. Worth $200? No. Better than Super Fight? Yes. There's more to it. I like the sound effects and the birds and the environment, minus the voiceover. I'd rank car game number one, that number two, Super Fight number three. My friends, there is only one final $200 game left to try. It is called Earthquake Escape. And apparently, this game teaches you how to escape earthquakes. Are we finally going to play a game that is worth it? Let's find out. That's loud. There's no volume. What does it want me to do? Oh, it wants me to go to exclamation points. Go! Oh, this is a drag thing. You drag the mouse. Go right here. Easy work. He's testing my patience. Let's try it again. Let's go. Let's go to this one. This is where it wants me to go. What is this? How is this supposed to teach me how to escape an earthquake? Oh my God. There's only like two exclamation points left. So we gotta go to one of these other ones right here. Wait, I'm not ready. No, where does it want me to go? Can someone help me out? I'm losing intelligence. I'm losing my mind. Right mouse button is crouch. <laughs> crouch between the chairs. Ah. That's a great idea. You crouch between the chairs. That way, if, if a falling item falls in the earthquake, the chairs, it'll hit the chairs instead of you. You genius! Guys, we beat the game twice now. <laughs> we did it! My friends, we have just learned how to survive an earthquake. You can't put a price on that. This is saving lives. So is this game worth $200? Absolutely invaluable. 10 out of 10 stars. No refunds. <laughs> Honestly, that was really fun playing those games. Do I regret playing the games? No. Am I ever going to play them again in my lifetime? No. Anyone who's watching this video, now you know not to purchase these for $200 a piece. GG's, my friends. That was interesting.